guys, I would like today to tell you about the selection of algorithms in data science. So how to select the best algorithm in data science? It means that in this world we have many, many algorithms that were developed until now. And if you go ahead to archive, for example, you can, have, say, you can see that every day there is many algorithms that, algorithm that, that are uh, proposed in the literature. So now, how to select one? Many criteria can be used in order to select your algorithm. The first thing is actually to consider the complexity of uh, this algorithm. You need also to see in terms of computation what is the computation power that you have. The second thing is the time need, of course, to, to have one solution. And finally, what you have also to do is also what is the domain of uh, application. Of course, these different criteria must be studied before going ahead in order to select or to implement the algorithm that you would like to do. In my this different uh, experiences, most of engineers start implementing, then testing the different algorithms. So you have to study the complexity of, it means without any implementation, that just only expect what do you have, what do you need, or, or what is the time needed in order to solve your problem. It means depending on the algorithm that will be implemented. In terms of computation uh, power that you have, do you have GPUs, do you have only CPUs, and then what is the cost of these implementations? Of course, this also must be studied before going through the implementation. Another thing is, do you, have, do you think that your company needs quickly to get results? What is the accuracy? of course also needed, and so on. These also must be taken into account because in this way you have, you can also go ahead to another family of algorithms to say, to deal with your problem. And finally, the domain of application, of course, if you are in computer vision, if you are also in, in uh, signal processing or other, or other application also, this will help you to select the best algorithms in order to solve your problem. So I can say that you have always, don't forget then, to address all these questions before selecting your algorithm to implement. Thanks.